The Dakota Valley Panthers, a topic of our next two-day segment, will DV season opener set to take place on Friday. The team's putting the finishing touches on what you could call a busy offseason. This year's Dakota Valley team looking to elevate its play after a 6-4 and four year in 2022. Dakota Valley's offense will have a bit of a makeover as Drew Luckin is slated to serve as the team's quarterback. The biggest change, though, former Nebraska Oscar Kenny Wilhite serving as the program's new head coach. With the new head coach comes new changes. Will Height looks to guide DV to a better season as the Panthers players say they're feeding off the new energy ahead of its week one showdown against Vermillion. He's putting everybody in the right mindset and we just want to be the best we can be and he's making everybody work as hard as they can. And he's, uh, he's definitely changed a lot of people. Uh, from the beginning of the season to what their mindset is now. I think we're, we're getting a lot more people to buy in. You know, Coach Wilhite, he's bringing that wisdom and that stuff that we don't get from a normal high school coach, and it's, it's getting people to buy in. The Panthers will have some key returners back, including running back and defensive back Jackson Boonstra and Trey Peel, as well as 13 additional seniors suiting up for Dakota Valley this season. DV hopes to replicate the start of the season they had in 2022. The Panthers burst out to a 6-1 start before dropping its last three games of the season. DV says they've got some big goals for the program, but it's the start of the season they feel will be key. Coming out week one, you know, with the, with the chip on our shoulder, ready to go, and uh, just taking it week by week, really. You know, day by day, we're trying to get better. We're not looking too far ahead. It took a minute to, to, to adjust. Um, when something new is going to take a minute to adjust. But I think these guys have really, really bought in uh, to what we're trying to get done. I, I didn't come here to go 500. I didn't come here to have a mediocre team. I came here to win. That's my mentality, and that's what I try to instill in them. 